Okay, so here we have uh, this uh, steering from a uh, Chevy S10. It's the uh, uses the power. This is the power steering. You can tell it's got the little hydraulic hoses down here that the power steering gets pumped to and from. And then uh, this part here is the part that swings to actually move your tires. And uh, on this end here, uh, this is where the uh, steering shaft from the steering wheel goes to. So basically it's, uh, it's kind of about like this from the driver's point of view. Um, you turn the steering wheel, this turns, use the hydraulic fluid to uh, more powerfully turn the arm which uh, turns the truck. However, uh, power steering requires the power steering pump and pulley and uh, all that stuff. It requires running off the engine. So what I'm looking at here. This guy is a uh, manual steering, which I got from a, uh, a salvage yard. So you can see it's, it's a little smaller, and uh, the other thing is it, it doesn't have any hydraulic hoses on it or anything. Um, it's got the shaft for the input from the steering wheel, and then it's got the output to the steering, and that's about it. But probably the most important thing is, if you look right here, these three bolt holes are what uh, bolt this onto the frame of the truck up under the hood and over here um, it's the same three bolt holes they line up in theory I haven't actually tried this yet but uh, as far as I can tell from uh, looking it up and talking to people this is a three bolt replacement to go from the power steering to the manual steering now the manual steering is off of a gen 1 Chevy S10 um, this was off a Gen 2 Chevy S10, but I've been told about a quarter of the original uh, Gen 1 Chevy S10s had the manual steering. So I'm going to try to swap it out and uh, see how that works.